Hello everybody and welcome back to Rudrick Plays Life is Strange, a story-based game that features player choice, the consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Last time we ended episode 1, and today we start episode 2 with an alarm going off. Snooze. Alright Max, rise and shine. No one ever saved the day by sleeping in. And every time we start a new episode, we get this little screen here, basically introing the game again. And as we can see, everything around us changes. You can see Max here has been studying time travel, it looks like. And it looks like there's some new stuff on her on her uh, board in front of her, too. And there's her new camera. And then there's more stuff on the floor, more time travel theory stuff. She's really trying to figure out how she has these powers and, you know, what it's affecting and stuff like that. Thank God the plant's not dead. Um, but here we are in episode two, Out of Time. Things are just really starting to ramp up. <laughs> I really like that shirt she's wearing. It's ridiculously cute. All right, Max, come on. Let's wake up here. We need to be careful because there's copyrighted music playing and I can't stop talking. And we could lay here for a while and listen to things, but we need to get up. Uh, rise and shine. And uh, superhero is dirty work. I need a shower. That we do. Turning off the copyrighted music. I don't think anything changes with this. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial. Wall. Yeah, no, this is the basically the same thing. Oh, Chloe, got a bail master. Breakfast is a go. You there, Mad Max? Like I said, always for you. No emoji. Meet me at the diner in forty. I'll be there. Do not be late, or I'll no time is on your side. After all, you did let step that door bust me. Thank you, Chloe. On my way. You are evil. Forty minutes or else. Even with all this crazy shit going on, it is so cool having Chloe back in my life again. I don't know about like that. Like, no time has passed. And we could use this, but all it really does is allow us to check our text messages. Actually, we can check it for other messages. Let's see. Mom. Nothing new from Victoria. Nothing new from Kate. Or Dad. Okay. Nothing is new. Sometimes stuff changes. What's this? That's her diary, and that will keep track of your decisions. Hi there. Whoa. Hello, zombie face. This is what happens when you research quantum physics all night. Yeesh. Timetable. Mrs. Hoida is still out sick. I heard somebody say she has severe depression. Poor Yeesh. Thing. That's really bad. Some of this stuff does change up a little bit. It's something here. Uh-oh. I wonder if I'll ever wear a watch again. I don't know. And we have a few... Good morning clothes. I hope you slept well. Yeah, there... Now, there's... shall it be my Gucci shirt with the Vuitton jacket? <laughs> yeah, so, some things definitely change. Now I have to wonder if any of these films are based on a true story. I can't even see what they are, so I couldn't tell you. There's a mess here, jeez. And the plant? Good morning, Lisa. Your leaves are lovely today. I may not have a green thumb, but I have a green finger. Yay, there's a camera. Oh, can we take a... Yes, we can. This take a picture selfie. will capture this crazy historic moment in my life. Let's do it. No smiling. Take your power seriously. <laughs> I kind of like the serious look in a selfie sometimes. Laptop. Let's see what we got. Warren is blowing up my inbox now. As long as he helps me figure this out. Oh, look, looky here. This is so insane, it sounds logical to me. <laughs> oh, Lord. This wormhole thing makes total sense, but doesn't explain how I can do what no scientist ever has. Yeah, no. I would say this is some crazy shit, but now I'm not so certain. Should I sign? Eh, and I thought think about I was it. into Halloween. Dana is not messing around here. Nope. It's like we have a uh, Halloween party in our future. And there's more books. I could rewind for days and read all of these books. Yeah, you Will could. Will I really find any insight into my power? Not sure. 
More stuff? I can't keep my eyes open, but I know there's a scientific answer. There's a lot of stuff here. It It's kind of crazy. I'll let you guys read all this. Here's the version you can just straight up read. It's a lot of theory stuff, so let's see. We've read those. I don't think anything is different here. Anything different here? It would be fun to get some peeps together and play a real game instead of drama games. <laughs> Looky there, Mystic Enchantment cards. I don't think I've ever found that before. But as always, since we're in Max's room... Meanwhile, my guitar gently sleeps. You guys knew I had to. But I have a reason for for doing this again. Notice anything different? Yeah, it's a different song. I believe every chapter she plays something a little different. And it's really cool. Uh, But as much as I would love to listen to this, I gotta get up and get ready. I will do an extended listen of that at the end of a ch at the end of an episode one day. But for now, we need to get our shower supplies. Whoops! Uh oh, I wonder Did if not mean to hit that. Again. There we go. Just because some ass pranked a girl's shampoo bottle and her hair fell out, we have to safeguard our toiletries. So summer camp. Yeah. Well. Okay, Max, let's hit the showers now. Uh, oh. Yeah. Seriously, do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like, now. Thanks, Jeez. Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I am so on it. Consider it done. Victoria. Okay, then. Fine, I won't disturb you. Screw you. Hey, Alyssa. Oh. Ow! Oh. Alyssa might want to move. Ow! Um, we can do something about that, so let's... Warn. Um. Ow! Hello? I guess I got a limited time frame before the thing actually move. Melissa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. We toilet wow. paper roll. No, that was close. Thank you, Max. You're welcome. What's new, Alyssa? It will have consequences. Why, hello again, Alyssa. Okay, Max. That's twice you've saved me from a projectile weapon. Mm -hmm. Are you my guardian angel? Hardly. That just I just have to a be sixth around. sense for trouble. I'm glad to help you out. Blackwell has a surplus of assholes. Oh, by the way, Warren said you borrowed his epic film flash drive. Mm -hmm. I didn't know you were a sci-fi geek like us. What's your favorite? I am a huge fan of Back to the Future. I love Back to the Future, of course, but... Who doesn't? Yeah. Can you imagine going back in time to Blackwell in the 1980s? We'd suffocate from all the hairspray. <laughs> you and Warren do know your sci-fi. Be careful. You might make Brooke jealous. I'll nah. just pretend I have no idea what you mean. Nah, I, I think Brooke and I'll be alright. Nothing new here, I don't think. Let's see what Dana's up to. Oh, look at her. Paper ball. This is both sad and pathetic. Oh yeah, we read that. Uh, Dana. I've never seen Dana this bouncy and happy without a pot of coffee. <laughs> Hi Dana, how are you? 
Much better than yesterday. I'm glad we talked. Me too. Me too. I know it's good to just talk about this stuff. Mm -hmm. You're almost psychic. I felt like you knew everything anyway. By the way, the have. best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. Woohoo! That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my uh. outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. <laughs> uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Why not? Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a rave. No. It does sound like fun. <laughs> now I have to go no contemplate raves. my party future. We listen to real music. Oh. Hmm. And there's makeup. Speaking of Halloween, look at all this makeup. At least Dana knows how to use it. Definitely. I don't think there's anything new here. Who will survive and what will be left of them? Don't say that out loud, dork. <laughs> Not single. Oh, Dana. Rollerblades? Rollerblades. Oh, I wanted to be a derby girl, but I almost broke my feet just putting them on. <laughs> if it makes you feel any better, I don't ever that try to so skate. so damn cute skate. how much Dana is into this Halloween party. I mean, she's a cheerleader, so she's got tons of spirit. So, oh dear. Trevor is making himself comfortable. Ugh, hope they don't get busted. Uh, not our business. Let's just walk away and pretend we didn't see that. Oh, looky here. It's Juliet and Brooke. Hey, Juliet. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? Hmm. It's not cool. That's so not cool. I didn't get wasted on camera and get busy with the Vortex Club. So? Kate's not like that, and you know it. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Ooh. Touche. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. Are you sure? Are you sure? I thought you'd be pissed. Not at you. Part of me was almost disappointed because I built up so much rage. Glad to see you're back in action. Definitely. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. Yay! That's the spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Talk to you later. Juliet's not bad, no. Excuse me. I'm texting Zach. Oh, I'm sorry. It's so important. Hey, Brooke. Oh, hi, Max. Did you see the snow? Did you see the freak snowfall yesterday? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. It was kind of weird. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Eh, yeah, maybe. Did you talk to him yet? I will later. I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll see you around. Oh, looky here. Get alive and move on, B-word. Taylor! Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria, as usual. Probably. Stella is probably not in her room. Go away! People's leaving! Erpf. Clearly not a morning person. Well, Juliet is, like, right there, so obviously she's not in her room. There's the bathroom. Wait, what the... Oh. Whatever. Apparently that one's taken. Oh, really? We'll bang for God. Really? The marks of Satan. Well, let's uh, get rid of that. Hey, Kate. Kate is an early bird. She might be up and gone. Probably. There's Max's room. Victoria's room. Nothing important in there. Well, I guess we can go shower now. Oh, wait, that's... Wait, who's there? Oh, this is Brooke's room. Brooke's, like, over there. Duh. Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay. Um, about to say I didn't accidentally... No, I didn't. Okay. Let's, uh... The bathroom is over here, so let's go in here and... Shower time! Oh, there's Kate. Hey, Kate. She looks so hey, sad. How are you doing? I'm here. 
Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. You're welcome. Anytime. That guy has issues. Definitely. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of The October Country? Yep. Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. I'm sorry. I really like Kate. She she is adorable. And oh my gosh, I feel so bad for her. And we've already seen... What the heck is this? Otter power? Oh, yeah, I'm yeah, so yeah, 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 that. Um, and, of course, the Rachel's a whore for crying out loud, people. Okay, well, let's uh, shower and get get all cleaned up and no you perverts you will not see max naked this th this right here is the most you'll see that's it ah shower time so this does show off the game's cool like watery effects as you see it like bouncing on her shoulders that's pretty cool uh oh kate Man, she looks sad. Oh, What's up, Kate? crap. School. That's it? That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. Shut off. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Ugh. Yup, I still have goddamn paint all over my face. You deserve good it. I think my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. Should've been we mean to you. The way. Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. Screw you. You can hang out with Kate. Or Max. Well, excuse me. I'm a lot nicer than you are and a lot cooler. Screw off, Victoria. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hate yeah. that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You wow, are such an Kate. evil biatch. I mean, I love Victoria. It. God, you're terrible. Let's just, <laughs> just jump more paint on you is what I should have done. Hmm. Well. I don't know about you guys, but uh, I'm really regretting my decision to spare Victoria now. Probably should have been mean. Probably should have been mean. I better get dressed than go give back Kate's book. Yeah, but before we do... Is that the link to Kate's video? Damn, Victoria is so fucking mean. Mm-hmm. Let's fix that little Even problem. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. And it will have decisions. Probably need to rinse our hands off. Hello? Water? Oops. Sorry. I forgot. <laughs> I did that at the failed recording and my first playthrough, and I still did that. <laughs> Uh, sometimes I just screw up. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, man. Well, let's go and get Kate's book and get dressed. Let's go in. What the? Well. Ugh. No fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up after I find this <sighs> book. Yeah, let's take care of that first. Okay, Max, where did you put it? Search here. No book here. Nope. Um, did we leave it on our desk? My desk is a pigsty, but I know it ain't there. Um... We'll deal with all that later. Is it in the floor? And nothing here. Well, one 
One other place to look. Oh, whoop. Hey, there's something here. Oh. Of course she just spilled soda on Kate's book. I better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Yeah, let's, uh, let's fix that little problem. And let's move this out of the way. Be gone, soft drink. And now let's get the book. Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. And before we do anything else, let's uh, change clothes. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week. And mm. he couldn't even rewind time. No, he could not. Can we get rid of this? What the heck is this? Man, this could almost be art if it wasn't so fucking sick and disturbed. Yeah, no. Can we get rid of this, please? Now I please? can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. Let's get As rid of this. As if I have to worry about being late anymore. I do have all the time in the world now. Yeah, we do. Oh, looky here. This totally reminds me of being a kid in my room. Sorry, Mom. I can make my bed whenever I want. Booyah. Eh, let's make the bed, even though I'm horrible about I doing this so in real life. Rebel. I always like my bed to be neat and tidy. Thanks, Mom. Oh, shit. Nathan's revenge. Even Chloe told me not to go to the principal. I don't think it matters. But I'm going to end things here. And I'm going to have Max play us out. And next time, we will go to Kate and give her her book back. So join me then, won't you? Rudrick out. Kate? You in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Max. Man, it's so dark in here. <laughs>